What's up guys, Nick Opinion here, and this is the Summon Pit. And inside the Summon, summon Pit is the Untamed Beast here. Now I will admit, this guy has killed me a good number of times. I had to get a team together to kind of even take him out, and he's still pretty damn rough. But um, this is one of the more challenging bosses on this game, and I thought I'd kind of give you guys a wee bit strategy here of um, really how to take him out. Because he is a pain in the friggin' ass, and he's probably killed you before if you played Destiny for more than a few hours. So, um, let's see. First and foremost, don't stay in this room. As you see, I'm getting shot from behind, and it's that thing right there. These things spawn in this room if you stay too long, and they kill you. So what you need to do is go outside and just kind of run around the outside of the map. Because, like, the first, like, five times I tried to stay in that room, and those things just kept showing up. And it's just not not helpful so once you save the day by reviving your other two teammates try to really find a pillar or something that's really what it's all about because as you can see in this footage I'm kind of hide behind this pillar and I zap them with my pulse gun and honestly that's one of the best strategies I got my two friends are kind of circling them enemies I'm fully using my pulse weapon on him and every time you get hurt a little bit just hide behind the pillars because he basically gets stuck behind everything once he gets loose and it's a pretty good strategy. You just gotta watch out because there's gonna be monsters all over the place. If you're doing this solo, it's gonna be very, very, very difficult. I would definitely recommend getting a friend for this to kind of distract the other enemies. One person kind of take out the enemies on the ground, the other person maybe distract the big guy and the other person shoot him from behind like they're doing right now. It's a good strategy to go at this guy with the team. He is very challenging. And uh, we'll see. So far, he's the most challenging opponent I've seen. Like, I haven't beat the game yet. I want to see what the final boss is, but this guy don't play. We're getting him down really good. It just kind of, it's, it's weak because these, these, these damn witches just showed up. <laughs> it's like each time his life goes down just a little bit, it like respawns a whole bunch of group of monsters. They can't make it for you that easy, but I will say this mission's been going on for about 20 minutes just fighting this guy. So, you best be up for a battle when you're fighting this guy. I personally think the pulse rifle will be the best. Maybe some shotguns would be good too. Now I gotta take care of these witches. But you really gotta strategize on what weapon to use against this guy. Because you can't just like use an automatic you have to use the pulse rifle really it's the best thing in my opinion because it hits them in like a circle group and so would a shotgun that's why i think a shotgun would be good too but you have to be too close for a shotgun a pulse rifle is like a long distance shotgun it's pretty sick got my supercharged too i might shoot that at them we got to get all these widgets first and foremost revive my guys again and die myself <laughs> Ugh, that's okay that's the price of saving your teammates so they can save you it's helpful it's helpful to be it's helpful to be helpful in the game. <laughs> this is not a good spot they're standing though. We gotta hide behind pillars for real. I'm gonna stay back over here. Let those guys get worked. See, see, they're coming over here. They know, they know. Try to take out these witches because you really, you wanna focus on the big guy, but when you have a hundred other things shooting you from the side, you really gotta forget about the big guy, team up and take out these witches first. It's gonna cost you the game. And after you put about 30 minutes at this and then die, and then put about 30 more minutes into it and die again over and over, you're about over it. You're like, no big guy. We're not dying this time. You're getting taken out, and this is how it's gonna be. I think we got all the witches. I love the little running zombie guys, they're cool. It's funny, this game, uh this game sold a lot, but it is very repetitive. But uh even my girl got into it, so there must be something right about this game. <laughs> There's something that makes me come back to it and want to keep playing it and beating it. I don't know what it is. It is just a beautiful game. Maybe it's just not a lot out for PS4, but we got this guy. You can't lose focus on the end, too. If I got to tell you anything, you will die right, right, right around when he gets 10% life. But you'll be like, we have it. Just rush in. And then he'll shoot your lasers. You'll end up dying. And you have to redo the whole thing. The whole thing. So just be patient at the end. Hide more. Just be patient because it's going to cost you your life and you don't want to go back and do this once you get him dropped this much you want to get him everything you have but you still want to be careful so i'm going to try to go around here and flank him but we got him we got him i'd be careful though i know he could just like run around and just take me out i don't want to die on the last second here i want to get my final shot on him he's focused on me too you got to pay attention to who he's focused on it's over big boy my pulse rifle got you i got one more shot on the pulse rifle you gotta get that ammo up too okay i got some ammo 
And he's done. I think my teammates know it. We're all just like, I'm shooting him from behind. They're shooting him from in front. Come on. It's a done deal. Oh, yeah. This is it. Oh, no. Don't die at the last second. Special weapon. Special weapon. Done. Done. So, uh, hopefully this strategy helped you guys a little bit. There is no really key to do it. You just gotta be patient, hide behind stuff, and just take your time wearing them down. Because it's gonna take a lot of ammunition. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll have more Destiny coming soon here in A Duck Opinion. Dust can fly. Like and subscribe. Talk to you guys later. Peace. abominations are still out there, growing among the darkness. I fear we may find out all too soon.